Hey guys, what's up? Uh, it's Winfield from Goose Tune today. So I wanted to show you guys the 21 through 22 uh, ECU and the F-150s and Raptors because I think it's good for you guys to get a visualization of what's happening when you're removing the front cover. So here we have uh, the front cover of the ECU, we have the ECU, but then we also have the, the, the cage around the ECU. So if you look closely, this is the top tab and the, the, the top two tabs actually of the ECU. So I want you guys to see how this works. So this tab is gonna come and allow the ECU to click into place. Same on both sides. And then on the bottom, it's somewhat similar. So you have, these are just clicked it in. You have these that are gonna need to come up. Click up, click up, and then you're gonna be able to slide the ECU out. So when I tell you guys in my instruction to squeeze it like a hamburger, you really do because you need to, if you take a look at this, you need to see this clip here come down. Once it gets dislodged from here, it can come out. See that? So when you push down and squeeze like a hamburger, this is able to come out. Now the bottom is gonna be a little bit more challenging because the same sort of thing is, is dealt with here, but once you get it out of the top, then you're able to just pull the cover away. Another thing that's not shown here is the, har the wire harnesses that are connected to this cage. So there's one here, 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 and those make it a little difficult to maneuver the cover as well. But as long as you squeeze like a hamburger, twist down, so squeeze and twist down, you're able to pop it out of these two clips that are down here, which there's only two. Some people say five, but there's only two. One, two, and then two more on the top, so four total. You're able to squeeze, pull down, twist down, and then pull out. And that's really it. So it's not too difficult. Um, some, some trucks I've heard can be a bear, but mine, I just did it now, it took me like a minute, maybe less. But yeah, that's what it looks like. So this is the visual representation of what the ECU cage, the whole situation looks like when it's in the truck. So once this covers off, you pop the two white tabs over here, you slide the ECU out, send it to Cobb, and they get it back to you within 48 hours, you're all set with the whole process. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you later.